Hello everybody, Redstone here, and welcome back to the maybe final episode of Earthbound. I'm pretty sure it should be. And uh, in the last part, we went through the lost cave, and we got here. And the cave Yep. The cave off. Here we go. Uh. Yeah. To me? Yeah. No. Yeah. Nick, are you surprised? It's me, Pokey. I assisted only the strong and able. That's Pokey. You guys look pathetic. The Apple of Enlightenment has already made you predict. Has already made a prediction, but I won't let. What the Apple of Enlightenment predict take place. You guys will be beaten by Gygus. Gygus will be stronger and more powerful an entity than any other. Why? Because of me. I was led by Gygus, and now I'm here. The Apple of Enlightenment couldn't predict this. Master Gygus, no, Gygus is no longer the wielder of evil. He has become the embodiment of evil itself, which cannot control his own. He is the evil power. Oh no. Here we go. Whoa, cool music. I like it. Alright, uh, so. Attack Gargus. No, no, heavily no, no, no. arm pokey. Okay. Alright. Do I want to go full force? Or just bash? It would be better if you went. So not rocking though, because that would be bad. No, you could, uh, uh, like you could use a bottle rocket. A big bottle rocket? I'll do freeze gamma to heavily on pokey. Big bottle rocket. June, you can bash. Now nah, you can use freeze uh, gamma too. Here we go, rock and beta. Say what now? I got shield, I got shield, oh my goodness, I'm just thinking. Okay, next time, um, you're gonna have to have shield and take shield on everyone. And oh wow, so, cool, so we didn't die. Multi-bottle rocket. Okay. That scared me. Alright, uh, alright, it's fine. Um, PSI uh, shield? Omega. Omega? Yes. Multi-bottle rocket? Good. Uh, no. Defense, uh, tower. Yeah, and, that's uh, it. And, uh, June use... Freeze. I hope I didn't accidentally hit Gygus. <laughs> oh, thank you, bud. With myself, I mean. Yeah, I'll thank you, bud. Oh no! I'm sorry. That's my fault. I just hit Epsilon, not the Mega. Uh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Uh. Okay, I'm just gonna do some healing to Connor here. Oh no. Oh great. Oh great, he just did an uh, offense down. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna just wanna do some nice attacks here. I'm gonna bash. Wait, Sophie, no. you can bash. Uh, no. Connor. Huh? I'm sorry. Defense Go shower. Go and... Back. Why? Yeah. Huh? Go to size. Uh, yeah. Two epsilon, the funny E. 
Yeah. That'll change it so it doesn't reflect. And so he can't attack you with it. Oh, okay. Uh, Defense Connor. Defense tower. Oh, man. Uh. Sorry. You can do whatever you want. I'm sorry. I think he's telling you how to fight. And... Oh no! No! Go on! Connor, Ju June! Ah! Uh. <sighs> having problems with this fight. Okay. It's okay. I can do it, I think. I'm gonna need to eat a, something soon. Here, I'll just bash Pokey. Ugh. She couldn't cast it. Unfortunately, the shield's dead anyway. Well, I guess fortunately, because, you know. Yeah, because I was do taking more damage. All right. Um. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna just do life up. Um. Nah, I don't want to waste more than I already. Uh, Sophie, use that. Connor, shoot. June, please heal her first. Thank you. Thank you. Sir, don't do too much to Sophie. Okay, good. Oh, good. That's, that's <sighs> All right, we're back in the pink. Oh man. All right, we're gonna. I'm just gonna do a uh, life up on Mega really quick. Seems like a good, like you know. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we needed it to do the first time. Where are, oh, our offense is going down. That's why we're attacking so weak. It's uh, of Sophie. Um, let's our fence up. Uh, alright. I'll bash. Sophie, you can use... Offense up. Connor, you shoot. Yes, smash attack. You might want to do the shield again. Uh, it, it'll go away. It'll all go away probably next turn, so. Oh, man. Yeah, but you don't want to give him a break to, you know, actually attack you with, uh, rocking. Alright. I want to do one more offense up, though. Okay. I understand you guys are already claiming to be heroes. Well, it's a gazillion years too early for you to oppose Gygus. You must pretty you must be feel pretty stupid without to keep fighting without even knowing what Gygus looks like. If you were to ever see Gygus, you'd be petrified with fear. You you you'd never be able to run away. That's how scary it is. So, do you want to turn me off the de devil's machine? Well, prepare to be amazed. Phase two. Oh. So isn't this terrifying? I'm terrified too. Gygus cannot think rationally anymore. He isn't even aware of what he's doing now. His own mind was destroyed by the incredible power. When the all mighty idiot. <laughs> yep, that's what he is. <laughs> and you, you will be just another meal to him. What about you? If he doesn't know what he's doing. Oh. Uh oh, we're attacking Gygus now. Yeah. Okay, do I now? I want another shield. Yes, I think. I'll just cast one up just in case. Yeah. I Connor, think... fire off a bottle rocket. Yes. Yeah. Use like. Nick, crazy. you cannot grasp the. Oh man, it did not work on. Oh no! 
Connor collapsed. Alright, I'm gonna do PSI. Alright, so for you bat, actually use freeze. And uh June, you you bash. Nick, you cannot guess the floor, true floor move. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Freeze, Omega! Do some damage, yeah. Connor was survived, okay. Uh but don't worry about the shield. That's not like it's flash magic, but it's not flash. Okay. Um Should I fire off another bottle rocket? Yes. Go crazy. Okay. Nick, you cannot grasp the true form of Gigas' attack! Oh! That's lightning, that's lightning. I wish it hit me. Yeah, fire the multi-bottle rocket. Did not work! That's weird. It should have worked. Try again? Okay, we still have a few more, so... Mm. Oh man, this is scary. Yeah, June, do 20 damage. Nick, you cannot grasp the true form. Oh no! Hit me! Hit me! <laughs> Dang it. Hit me, baby, one more time. <laughs> Gygus is solidified. This should do it. Do some damage. It did not work. That's weird. Okay, I'm, not, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna fire another one. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna let's see. Let's fire off the heavy bazooka. Yeah. Hopefully that'll work. Yeah, that did some damage. So if you use some freeze... Oh man, you can't do too much anymore. Here, why don't you eat a brain food lunch? Yeah. You're just all alone in the void, surrounded by the greatest evil. Sit down and have lunch. <laughs> just sit down and have some lunch, guys. We're gonna be fine. Nick, you're gonna... Oh, wow! Well, the form Gaius! The Franklin Badge! Oh no. Hey, 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 you must really be the end of your rope. Wait, which our... one? You four are the only force fighting against us, and, and here you stand, waiting and burned up with the rest of the garbage in the universe. Ha! So sad I can't help but shed a tear. You know, my heart beating incredibly fast. I must experience absolute terror. Do you want to scream and for help here in the dark? Ha 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 ha. Why don't you call your mommy, Nick? Say, Mommy, Daddy, I'm so frightened. Think I'm gonna wet my pants. I know you have telepathy or something, so just try and call for help. Your pathetic, weak heroes are just... No one will help you now. <laughs> Don't worry, your pitiful suffering will be over soon. Whoa! Oh no! Sophie, eat your lunch! Yes! Oh, I don't man. know what to do for you. Uh, call for like help. Really do need help. Call for help. Pray. <laughs> uh, defend. Bash. It's not right. Not right. Not right. You know, grab the true form. Oh no! Sophie's body is solidified. June, uh, just use, uh, eat a brain food lunch. It hurts, it hurts. So if you pr please give us strength. If it is possible, please, somebody help us.
look here. All of Mr. Saturn felt a new, strange feeling they had never experienced before, and they all started praying for the safety of Nick and his friends. So what if you didn't know about the turn is here? Gaia's defense became unstable. Whoa! Whoa! Look at that! We're still gonna need help. Alright, uh, pray. Uh, shoot. Bash. Ah, girl. Oh. Jesus, I'm so sad. Nick. Pray? It hurts. Nick! Why is he, like, calling out for help? Please give us strength. Anyone who can hear her, please help us. Runaway 5! Suddenly, one of the Runaway 5 felt something stop him, and he prayed fervently for the safety of Nick and his friends. Forty-seven damage! Haha! <laughs> Eat it! Alright, bash. Uh, pray, shoot, bash. June did some damage. Nick, 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 Oh, full star. So V's father thought he somehow heard his daughter's voice, and he prayed sincerely for the safety of Sophie and her friends. Eighty-two damage to Gygus. We're getting stronger. All right, so if you keep praying, shoot and bash. I'm happy. I feel good. I'm happy. You cannot grasp the true form of Gygus. It did not work. It did not work. Connor couldn't stop crying. June got paralyzed. Sophie, pray. Keep praying. Please give us strength. Anyone who can hear our plea, help us. Tony. The Maxwell. Suddenly, Tony felt anxious about Connor, and he prayed strongly for the safety of Connor and his friends. One hundred and eighty six damage to Gygus. Let's pray. Shoot. Do nothing. <laughs> Go back, Nick. It's not right. Not right. Not right. You cannot grasp the true form of Gygus' attack. It did not work. It did not work. Connor got hurt and collapsed. Come on. Oh. June's. Oh. One of the June's fan club. To a June's fan club. Three of June's fan club. A young woman in Delam woke from a dream in which Prince June died, and she began to pray for the well-being of June and his friends. Thing is, Connor's the one dead right now. Uh. <laughs> 389 damage! Whoa! Alright. I think I'm going to uh, give Connor the couple life noodles. And That's a nice idea. What? That's a good idea. Uh, June, you need to heal your paralysis. Healing Gamma? That works. Nick, 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 I load again! It hurts. Nick! I'm happy. 
Sophie, Sophie, pray! Frank! Suddenly Frank recalled Nick's shining young face and began to pray diligently for the safety of Nick and his friends. Seven hundred and sixteen. There you go, Connor. You're back in the game. All right. Let's pray, Connor. Yeah, you need to shoot him and uh, defend. It's not right. Not right. Not right. Ah, girl. Oh, Sophie, pray. Suddenly, Nick's mother felt terribly uneasy, and she began to pray for the safety of her son and his friends. This is gonna do a shit ton of damage. 1,575 damage! Whoa! Is this the emulator? A four, I mean. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Defend? Oh, defend? Pray. Ah, girl, oh. It hurts, it hurts. Ah, yeah. You cannot grasp the true form of guy gets a stack. Lightning, Franklin Badge. Franklin Badge again. Sophie prayed from the bottom of her heart. I can't think of anyone else. Someone, anyone, please help us. Is that the emulator? What? Sophie's call was absorbed by the darkness. Oh no. Is is that like static and stuff? Oh no, that's there. Oh, okay. Pray, defend, defend. It hurts, Nick. It's not right, not right, not right. I feel good. You cannot grasp the true form of Gagas' attack. Ow. Oh, hey, Sophie, no. Sophie, pray. Please give us strength. Sophie and her friends calls touch her the heart of friend P. Uh, all right. No, he. <laughs> it's for the kids. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Three thousand two hundred twenty-five. No way. He <laughs> kept praying. Five thousand four hundred thirty-eight. Nahi kept praying. What the, oh my! Nofi kept praying. <laughs> yes! Yes! You beat Gargus. You really did beat Gargus. <laughs> Is it just me, or do you see, like, a baby? Like, w when he was stretched out, when, look, when Gygus gets a little stretched out, like that, like this. Hit that, where his face is, if the darker portion looks like a baby. I know, a lot of people have said that, that's why they say that, huh. well, now it's supposed to represent a, a unborn baby, and oh. we're actually doing... Alright, Nick. <laughs> Nick, now I, well, it's going to seem like I'm running away. But perhaps I'll just sneak away into another era to think about my next plan. It's going to... It's going... It's a good bet that we'll see each other again. Alright, I'll be seeing you. Now, so now, which one of us do you think is a really good guy? Oh, crap. Cool guy, yeah. Cool guy. I know I couldn't read it quick enough, so I... Just... 
I saw two O's, so I thought, good guy. Oh, you just turned your TV off. Way to go. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Sure you didn't. Oh. No! The war against Gygus is over. Oh. You won. There's no going back. Fuck. But the evil's gone. What? Wait, what was that? What? Is... I have a feeling I know what's happening, but I'm not totally sure. would it be if they lost their lives to save everyone? So they were willing to make the sacrifice. Yes! Now we're back home, all safe. Now if my theory is correct, there should be no more enemies, right? Because Gygus influenced them all. Actually, there's a glitch that you can do, but yeah, pretty much you should not be any enemy. Okay, our travels together end here. I must return to Delon and use this experience for the good of my country. Nick, Sophie, Connor. Let me demonstrate a strange power before I go. I realized this power as a child. PSI farewell. Now... I'll see you again someday. <laughs> present! 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 Talking Sophie, Nick... It was great to hang out with you guys. It really was! I'm glad that I had the chance to use some of these theories that I had been studying so hard. It's remarkable. If, just maybe, well, if you two get hitched someday, maybe I'll be the one that fix your broken electronic appliances. I'm going to stay here for a while and see if I can learn more from Dr. Ennis, I mean, from my dad. So it looks like this is goodbye for now, my friends. And he's calling his dad his dad finally. Yes. He's not worried about it. Nick, will you escort me home? No! Of course I will. I'll miss you all, all of you, but I have to go back to b being just a regular kid. Well, I gotta get going. Funny fact, if you said no, he said that, uh, then I'll escort you back. <laughs> Letter from Tony. Yeah. Feel free to read it. Dear Connor, everything's really going great here. I wish I could have gone with you and your adventure even just part of the way. But instead I'm sitting here waiting for you in winters. I want to see you again as soon as possible. I can't wait to see your cheerful face. I bet your glasses are dirty, but if you come back I'll clean them for you. 
like I said, I'm waiting for you. Yours truly, Tony. P.S. Don't show this letter to anyone. Oh, uh, um, I don't have it. I, I don't have it. Oh, dang it. There's a letter from Mom inside. Sophie takes it. That's from Miss Mom. Dear Nick, how are you? Since you left home on your journey, things have changed around here. For example, I don't have as much laundry. Although, we don't seem to eat steak as much as we used to. I heard that you defeated some universal evil character. What was it? Googie or something like that? Well, that sounds really great. I want to hear all the details, so hurry home, okay? Stacy, Steven, and I are waiting for you. Love, Mama. Thing is, it sounds exactly what something my mom would say. You know what? Every mom's mom would say. She what was it? Googie? She can't get the back yet. Yeah. Letter from kids inside. That's the Sophie. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine too. So are me. Me also. Me okay. Please come and play with us at the Polestar Preschool. Oh yeah. One more thing. Bring us some presents if you have any. Sincerely, your friends at Polestar Preschool. <sighs> That's so cute. Me, okay. Let's go to Tucson. Well, you don't have to. Like, is there someone else you want to check out first? A lot of different people say different things. And now there's no monsters except for in the um, museum in Summers. Unless you, did, like, kill them. Hmm. Wait, go look at the door. Huh? What? Check the door. We will be closed for a short period. Thank you for many years of support. Mr. Poochie Field Manager, Chaos Theater. Huh. Poochie Fudge, Evan Poochie. <laughs> oh, if you go in there, uh, Berglin Park, go pretty much tell you that Everdred's dead, only subvertly. Oh. Let's talk to this guy. But the kidnapped girl was saved. What? You saved her? It's hard to believe. You don't seem like the hero type at all. Thank you, sir. I just saved... I just Why? saved the world! <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, shoot. One second. The battery's gonna die. Taking her home. Oh. Nick. Thank you for escorting me home. There was something I wanted to tell you, but I've forgotten it. I'm sure I'll remember the time I see you again. Well, I guess that's it. Goodbye. Uh, so long. See ya. Bye. <sighs> that's okay, you'll come back many, many times. And now you have a house to go move into. <laughs> I'm lagging like every few seconds. Oh, there we go. We're starting to be better. Nope, nope, we're still jerking. Uh, I think I'm gonna walk home. Where did I even come in? Is there any other place that you'd like to go check? Huh? Is there any other place that you'd like to go check? Nah, I think I just want to go home. Okay. Where did what? I even? Where did I even come in yet? Oh, it's north. Um, left a little bit more. Sorry. Oh, could you call up the Stoic Club, though? The Stoic Club? Yes. When I get through here. Okay. Everything's bright and happy again. You're doing your victory lap. Yep. Onet. Huh, I wonder if uh, Captain Strong beat Earthbound. Mm hmm. Here we go. Let's go in the hotel. Even the music in here is all cheery. Mm -hmm. This is a lazy co cowpoke sto stop and go, yeah. Where did the new truck stop? We just opened. 
What the, the Stoic Club? That lame old place shut down ages ago. We totally remodeled the place. Now we got the loud music, great food, and really rowdy crowds. Listen, buddy, I'm too busy now. I'm talking right now. Just drop by anytime. You come enjoy, I promise. Beep, beep. Huh. <laughs> I thought you'd get a kick out of that. <laughs> Oh, talk to him. Remember we were talking about him before? You used to look much more helpless. <laughs> He's the one who asked you okay the day you came home, and you looked upset. Ah. You know, because you're dealing with buzz buzz. But you fulfilled his mission. Oh wait, uh, go, go down, and go see, uh, Pokey's mom. Salutations, you're the boy next living next door. I heard your family's in debt. Miss, Miss Mitch told me about it. Well, live and learn. You'll just have to get plugged away. Who is that? Talk to Lardna. Lardna. As usual, you're wearing your gruppies. So what, what do you want? My son isn't at home now. He's walking around somewhere. My husband has also gone. Oh, yes. This is Mr. Pretty Man. He's always has great advice. He's a real gentleman, he is. You'll be happy that you met him. Where's Picky? Picky why would be upstairs? Not that she cares. I haven't seen you in a while. You look cool. I'm nowhere near as cool as you. I'm just average cool. I like Picky. Poor abused kid. She doesn't know where her husband is or like all this son is. She doesn't really care. Actually, he's in four sides, so. Uh. Whoa. Everybody, I'm lagging. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, wait, no, no, call your dad. What? Go save your game. Don't worry, you have time. After all. Chance finally over. Please come back here. The photo man brought an album by. I'd like to take a look at it with you. Okay, call your dad. Oh. Hello? Is this Nick's residence? Is Nick around? Ah, you're Nick, alright? It's me, the tough businessman. You remember from Deep Darkness? I never got the money back that you borrowed, but lucky you, I bumped into a your dad and he paid the debt for you. I just wanted to let you know. Gotta go now. Busy, busy, busy. Slam, beep. Hi, it's your dad. To get to the next level. <laughs> I guess I don't need to tell you this anymore. Next week will be your birthday, Nick. I'm trying very hard to be home for that big day. I'll be sure that to get you a good present. I've been following your adventures closely, but I want to hear about them from you in person. You sound a lot more mature over the phone. Well, I'll see you at home then. Bye. Click. Beep. 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 Did you finish doing everything that you wanted to? Yes. Okay. Now you can finally share your incredible experiences with me. You did so well. I love how my mom walked in just then. Cool. Well, <laughs> bed, so don't worry. Yeah. Does this do credit roll? Wow. And then something else afterwards. Picky Mitch. Lardna Ale Ella Pick Pokey Mitch. Buzz Buzz. Bye, Pokey. Lie or exaggerate? Frank Fly. The Sharks. B. H. Perkle. Big Head Perkle. Captain Strong. Onet Police Force. <laughs> Sophie's mom, Sophie's dad. Sophie! Oh, thank you. Yay! <laughs> Orange Kid. Apple Kid. 
Mr. Everdead. The Runaway Five. Plus one is getting shot. Happy Happiest. Carpenter. Carpenter. Bubble Monkey. Tony and Maxwell. Tessie. Tessie Watch Club. Brick Road. Dr. Andonuts. Connor. Mr. Saturn! <laughs> Master Belch. George Montag. Gerardo Montag. Kala Rama. Gildegard Montalori. Oh, there's... Venus. June's Master, Star Master. Dungeon Man, Noble Warrior. Tended Tribesman. What's the saddle? What are you doing there? You're not a Tenda. <laughs> Flying Man, I only killed two of you. Everyone else. And the rest of you unnamed people. And them. <laughs> Dad and Steven. And you said the telephone. And me! And St Tracy and Mom. Peace. Not quite done yet. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, all right, everyone, bye. <laughs> oh, Fire Man, you came to troll my last video. You have to take a picture of the person who won the game. <laughs> Aww. And there's all your pictures. Thank you, e toy. <laughs> I should say I got the Mr. X at e toy. Didn't work. Oh well. Yeah? Is it? Is it what? Bringing back the fondness of memory? Yeah. It's good they didn't lie. I think I missed that one. No, you got it. If you didn't get it, then it wouldn't be there. Huh. There's a 
crazy LSD coffee. <laughs> Yeah, those translators were amazing. They did their very best to keep it as close to the Japanese as they could. There was only two of them. I know. Jeez. looking down at you. <laughs> what is crazy that guy doing in my throne room? <laughs> that English that voice is. <laughs> okay, we like a uh, sunny secret. Okay, this guy? <laughs> Caveman! And he's smiling for the camera too. This is a crazy taxi. <laughs> And? <laughs> uh. <Aww. laughs> There's still something left. She's gonna stab me in the face. <laughs> Too touch to stab you in the face. I don't know. She's pretty vicious. <laughs> so, uh, is it supposed to be here for hours? Just a little bit longer. Oh, there it goes. Is there like a third credits? No. No. And it happens again. This is terrible. You just got to bed after all that work, and now someone's knocking annoyingly. Oh, no! <laughs> a letter arrived from my brother Pokey. It's addressed to Nick. There's no stamp, and it's not time for the mailman to come. Anyway, I brought it over. It says, come and get me, losers. Spankity, spankity, spankity. I wonder where he is. Great. The end. Question mark? <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching this amazing Let's Play. Thank you, Mary. And thank you, Sophie. No for... crying until the end. <laughs> I guess...
see you in the next form of video. Bye!